So sometime in 2020, I decided to start content creation. I was out of university, fresh graduate. COVID was in town and there was not much to do, no jobs. Uh, my career as a photographer was dying, so to speak. Many people often think that, you know, when I was a photographer, I used to earn a lot of money. No, that wasn't the case. Photography was what sustained me in university and coming out, you know, into the um, um, real world, I discovered that as a dead, things were more than just pictures. I discovered that, you know, the world was going from pictures to videos and content was beginning to become king as the popular cliche was back then, content is king. So I, you know, by chance met someone and we started creating content together. And that content involved me traveling around Nigeria, shooting stories and shooting places across the country. And I've always loved traveling. I've always, always loved to travel. I was so bad at that point in time that you could call me week in, week out, and I was in a different state. That was how, you know, much I traveled. Then, you know, the content started and we were doing quite well on that channel, but it was hard at some point. It was hard, you know, putting content together, running my business, pay a few works. I was beginning to grow back then. And, um, you know, it, it meant that uh, that partnership sort of weighed it down. But I didn't allow that to weigh me down. So I decided to start Peter Stanley's piece. And the idea was, as a back then, I used to live in my parents' apartment and I had, you know, just a single room to myself. So it was a tiny space with big ideas, and that was where I got in the Peter Stein space. And 2001, I began to travel, you know, across the country and create these stories, you know, unique stories, but this time for my own channel. And that was how the vast majority of you are watching this discovered me. And, you know, um, you began to fall in love with my content. My content is specifically for consumption by people who are interested in, you know, history, who are interested in, in travel, who are interested in seeing places across the country that regular media would probably not show you. Or even if regular media shows you those places, not as in-depth as, you know, I would have showed you. But along the line, the contents, the ideas began to to metamorphose. And that's one thing I've always tell every content creator. Don't be afraid to change. Don't be afraid to try something else. And you know, you can try it and it might work out and you may try it and it may not work out. But uh, never be afraid to try things. He who doesn't try would never know the outcome of things. So I try several new other forms of content that you probably are aware with. But uh, you know, despite the fact that I really wanted our content type to to grow and to, you know, develop into something beautiful. Um, he just couldn't metamorphose into it. And I'm not here to go into the details of that, but uh, I just wanted to create this video so as to let you know that, you know, uh, as Terminator would say, I'll be back, but this time I'm back. <laughs> so the idea is simple, Peter Stein's space is coming back as the business time space you've always known. The idea is to tell Africa stories by Africa people and to create, you know, videos like this around the African continent. So what do you, or what should you be expecting going forward from Peter Stein and space? Uh, travel content, obviously. We would be going to several other places across the country. This time around, we've explored or have explored a lot of Western Nigeria, and it's time to finally go away from this geopolitical zone. I've been to the east, I've been to the Middle Belt, but I haven't been to the north, like core, core north. I haven't been to the core north, but I've been to the east, I've been to the south, I've been to the west, I've been to the Middle Belt. So we're starting to take you to all those other places still, but now begin to show you, you know, those places and have it documented in, you know, the visual format. And also more sit down videos around African history, around African culture, around, you know, Nigerian history, Nigerian culture. I've been thinking about creating a podcast that would talk about you know this kind of things, and it's really just it's an interest for me. It's something that I'm really interested in, and I just want to do it because I love it, and um, you know see what happens monetary wise from there. And also in this period, the channel was also able to you know be monetized in November last year. So 
as running on this channel and also you know bringing in money in and that's um, one of the ways of making money for a youtube channel it's not you know for now because we're just starting out or we don't really have those mega mega numbers it's not really mega mega money right now just a few cents here and there but your contribution to you know watching our channel or watching our videos that we uploaded going back and playing previous videos watching playlists and those kind of things would also increase you know um the amount of money that you know we get to make on this channel because one of the challenges you know currently that i'm facing why i haven't been able to travel even since when you know um the change became necessitated was because um more well, is because rather right that um you know funds are quite you know not so much with me and i need to manage what i have with me and make make room for you know the essentials that be used and those kind of things before i can be able to now say well can i put this money into this um so content so far has been a source of income but uh you know it can become better and that's why i'm also using this video to let you know that if you click the description box of this video you can see several other ways that you can you know um donate to peter standing space and those donations will be used into funding these travels that will tell you those stories that you want me to bring to your screen and finally um i just want everyone watching this video to also know that i'm at a point or a space in my life whereby my goals and aspirations are the most important thing to me and i want to make sure that i achieve them as much as i can it's important that you know the the goal remains the same and i keep on targeting that single goal and achieving that aim that i've always wanted to achieve it makes me happy when you all watch a video that i make of me going to you know, somewhere extreme and doing something or finding a raw story i'm bringing it to you and you all experiencing you know that story from the comfort of your home that that brings me joy when you comment on those videos you know and um i just really want to make more and more of those videos i create a name for myself and you know be able to to tell the african story by the african people um until i see you guys again welcome to possess status peace